wrongdoing, you know, occurred um, in terms of, you know, it was it was between consenting adults. Yeah, that's being the most important consenting thing, right? adults. So no, when I think that what I what really angers me is that people are on Tumblr seem to be making some sort of concerted effort to try and make Shin apologise for nothing, for being a man or just for talking to people or, you know, just if, if you're going to talk to, you know, and also it's not like anyone ever met up or anything ever happened, like mm. that's any kind of problem. If there was, then we would have yeah, I'd like, and made yeah. some things. Yeah. But I looked at it at the time and I was like, this is bullshit. So fuck off. Right. And it pisses me off. Really does when people try and bring up this shit. Mm. Like, who cares if if she cheated or not? Do you know what? It's not even that he. And, and I'm pretty sure he didn't. But there's certainly no evidence of that, and no one's coming out saying no, that. No, he well, cheated. Exa exactly. Or I anything mean, like that. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? So it's not like he even did something that would be morally slightly inappropriate. So, I mean, there's there's no proven or kind of proper evidence stuff to to burn someone's bridge like that. And do you know what? Some people have said to me things like, um, you know, what's the difference between you know, someone that you're working with now, like Shin, and someone that you're not working with anymore, like Ridge Dog. Well, there's quite a big difference. You know, Ridge Dog um, met a fan and impregnated her and went <laughs> off to live in the other side of the country and not pay his <laughs> child support to his kids. Yeah. I mean, that's, that was, yeah, I mean, that's the sad I mean, thing. I mean, that's a bit different, yeah. right, yeah. isn't it, to, you know, chatting to some girls three years ago. Why are we, why are, people love a bit of drama. People love... I think I think to, to ultimately the it's fall. they love to see dirty yeah. laundry. They love to see celebs without makeup. They love to think that their favourite people have these flaws and are totally fucking, you know, flawless. Uh, so, you know, these totally fucking flawless people are actually. They love it. They love it, and it's it's it really makes me angry when because Tushin and <laughs> so I the chat's going bananas. Get like so super I think, upset. I think the <laughs> going so bananas. A banana suit outside. <laughs> Who the fuck is that? Why are we going to have... I don't like, know. I this don't is know. The, like the most serious yeah, real know, talk on the end of like a really fun stream. And then stream. some fucking giant banana walks in. Um. <laughs> I mean, I don't think we're trying to <laughs> cover anything giant up giant banana here, outside, right? sorry. Because there's, there's, if, you know, if, if, if anyone has any real problems with anything that is I think really, this, is, this listen, is the more important... This is an important message. Do you know what, I like, honestly, an important message. No, no, that, but that, if, you, if you ever have any wrongdoing done to you, please, 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 please do not come to... Us, any other members of the Oxcast, we are not tra trained professionals. No, we don't know how to help you. We don't know how to advise you. We don't know anything. Please there go are to like of proper help people, proper at your authorities and or, or and organizations. The world in the internet is is you know a place that you have to pay attention on, and it's 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 always been that way. The reality is is that we were we we take serious things very seriously. Okay. Mm. Anything that is actually wrongdoing is serious. But if you start talking about me being flirting on the internet with girls as allegations or some sort of some sort of abuse or things or malicious or deception or any of these words that, that are not right ah. real and you start making headlines, fuck you. Honestly, because you are stirring up shit and making people upset and ruining people's lives who have no it can it, I, I, again. It's very, 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 very damaging to throw around any of these things publicly. And we don't like and to talk about. No, exactly, right? because, because, it, because it, draws it draws more attention, more attention to, to it. Right? Exactly, and, and all so the rest. That's why three years ago I said we're not doing it. But the problem is, is we now made someone redundant, and I think. Well, it, it's it, it's in the, it's in part. The, the, I think you have to yeah. take what she says with a pinch of salt. Well, because, again, yeah. Because I, all I'd say again is I think this is this, this issue arose out of again another allegation around Toby Turner and other stuff. And there's every time of anything happens, there's a lot things, of yeah. Right? There's a lot of bad things and out there. And they are genuinely horrible people. You well, again, at, I don't. But the things I don't know. The thing is, in the same way as someone's just saying something, I haven't looked into it. I don't know anything about any of these people. I'm just told, oh yeah, this person's a rapist or something like that. And all of a sudden, I'm meant to believe that though, you know, this other YouTuber over there's that. I don't know. But the problem is, is as soon as someone says it. I'm it's gonna, like I'm, Notch, I pretty much, that's okay? it. Yeah. It's like what happened at Michael in 2011. Yeah. Everyone loved that drama because Notch came out and said, the Yogscast, the dicks, they were swearing, they've got this island of egos, all this stupid shit, right? And it was because, it wasn't really because he believed it, but people would say, oh, why would Notch say that if he didn't mean it? It's because he's been told it by his members of staff and he's heard it in hearsay and they've talked about it and that's the conclusion he's come to. He hasn't intended to, you know, lie any more than he's 
you know, he's obviously upset, and, and, and this is... It's funny how this shit, shit gets out there, man, and it, it really annoys me. It does really annoy me, and I'm, I'm kind of sick of, of, of feeling a bit guilty about something which isn't a fucking problem. You know, it really isn't. Um... So, it's just, like I said, it's, 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 I don't know. It's, it's sad because it, it, it comes up all the time and it is, it's one of those things that, I don't know, I think should be left to those yeah, and people. You know what, like, and again, if anyone out there if feels anyone else has personally a real affected issue, by these you issues, go out and, please, and, and please, please, please yeah. go to the authorities ah. or, or organisations that can help you. Please yeah. don't talk to, like, if it's, if Hannah it's three years or something ago, like that. You know, Shin is chatting to some people on Twitter or in his personal Facebook or whatever, and these people are all consenting adults, and you know his chat messages get posted on Tumblr, and he gets portrayed as some kind of you know if they can edit these things, or even if they're fake, it's you know there's it's it's kind of not okay, and I don't like it coming up again like it's some sort of because it's like a ghost from our past haunting us. In a way, like there's there's loads of kind of drama, and people oh, people really latch onto it, man. It stresses me out. It really but the, me the thing I'm, is, I'm, it's like I'm kind of done I'm with as, it. But I'm as guilty for it. You know, I was telling you the other day. You know, there was a super injunction out in the UK about some married guy in America um, who had a threesome. Look, and he's got married and kids. Just, but that's the thing. But yeah. I, I, that so instantly you, to me, you have your DMs open, right? But yeah, and you get tweeted all sorts of <laughs> people send you all sorts of dick pics. Yeah, and yeah, stuff like this, you know, yeah. Does Cox that, Central. Does that make you Cox Central. Does it make me soliciting dick pics? Like, I enjoy them, but yeah, I don't. I don't. I don't, know. I don't ask for them. You know, I might. I might put them on the on the big projector. Obviously, outside. This, now we've talked about it. This this whole thing's gonna kind of just be posted about and then we talk yeah. about. But hopefully, this will no, be no. the last time. Because this is gonna be the last time I address this. Yeah, but it won't. I, this this I won't. I think everyone else will the, address yeah, it with their own exactly. ways. Do you yeah. know what? I don't kind of don't want people to to talk about what is essentially. Very embarrassing for one of our friends and his personal private dirty matter, yeah. stuff, p dirty laundry or private stuff, which shouldn't be going about and seen, be seen by anyone else. Um, because unless anything, any wrongdoing has happened, which it hasn't, as far as I know, um, and from, from the very little screenshots that we have from three years ago, I'm going to always, you know... Take the side of, of, of my friend who's, who I trust and, you know, I spoke to him about this today and he's really sad and really embarrassed about it. It's, it's damaging his personal life and it's, it's upsetting his relationship. Um, and he feels, you know, kind of, he, he feels like he should feel guilty about it in some way, even though he's got nothing to feel guilty about, right? Because it's embarrassing to have your, your, your stuff posted like that. You know, if you had a load of personal private chat with someone, you know, that you saw, that you had that was posted, you'd be pretty uncomfortable with that. You'd be pretty embarrassed about that. And that's how Shin feels. Um, and it's not cool. Is it? No. No, exactly. It's, like I said, it's, it's, it's annoying. And like I said, for the people out there who are creating the drama and, and talking about it, this isn't going to satisfy them in any way, shape, or form. But the reality is, is that we are not the people to complain to in terms of you know we've we've spoken to you know to shin we've we've looked at the same things you've looked at and from what we can see no wrongdoing you know, wrongdoing has occurred you know in in terms of any legal issues there's no reason to distance ourselves with him he's he is still a fantastic amazing funny guy um, and I honestly I feel very comfortable you know, talking about this at all exactly but and it's, it's, it's us, yeah. right and do you know what I mean I saw a couple of tweets I saw a couple of tweets like a year ago, and I didn't reply, and then I saw a couple of tweets yesterday, and people were chatting about it in chat. Mm. So I thought it was time for me to say something, even though I don't want to. Mm. And, but I feel like if I don't say something, which is fuck you to all the people who are making a mountain out of a molehill, um, or trying to drum up drama when none exists, fuck you. Um, but to anyone who's actually been hurt by this stuff, um, and is upset. Talk to talk to people about it. Talk to talk to like, you know. There's there's lots of other people out there. But again, not us. <laughs> you know, in all fairness, because it's I can't so I can't right? yeah, I can't help We're you. We're so different to <laughs> to, to, to look. Oh, it's, it's really difficult to talk about this stuff. Holy shit! But anyway, well, we've talked we enough. We talked, talked enough. And enough. like I said, 